YouTube, what is up guys? Today I got the Duncan Orbit GTX. So this is the bi-metal version of the Duncan Orbit, which I reviewed a couple weeks ago and I absolutely loved. So smash that like button, let's go over there and let me show you how this thing's packaged and we'll get right back to playing with it. All right guys, so we got the standard Duncan box and check out this color. I really like this, like lime red with the stainless steel rims, this looks sick. So, I, not too long ago, checked out the regular Orbit. I actually got this in a trade, and when I got this, I didn't even know what it was. Like, I didn't know, I didn't know it was Tal Mordox, yo, yo, or hopefully I'm saying his name right. Uh, but yeah, but this is his bimetal version. So this, I believe, is only like 40 bucks, and it is one of the best $40 yo-yos on the market, hands down. Well, this is the bimetal version, but it is actually quite a bit different. They, it, they made it more angular. Looks like the gap is slightly, slightly smaller. Um, but yeah, I mean, it looks, it looks like a lot more aggressive of a shape. Um, this is actually normally like my go-to, but I was so impressed with this yo-yo. I'm really excited about this. Here's the next to the Grasshopper GT, which is another, or the Grasshopper X, I think it's called. One of the other bimetals from Duncan. Um, this is also a yo-yo that they make a monometal version, um, and then they make a bimetal version. Now here's the next to the Freehand Aluminum. Look how much wire it is. Um, I'll put the specs right there, right there, so you can check those out. Um, but yeah, I love how there's no there's no laser engraving. Which normally I'm not like that big of a fan of when there's no markings in here. But I like it on this one because they did put some markings on the ring itself. Like you can see right there, we got we got the Duncan logo. Getting a lot of glare from the camera. Sorry. Then on this side we got Orbital GT X. Oh, really, really cool. Uh, the shape of it is just really nice. Very aggressive, but still rounded off where you want it to. And actually, feels really nice. Red pads, because it's Duncan, and red pads are awesome. Bearing feels very nice. Probably a Diffio concave. If I had to guess, I'm pretty sure they, all their nice areas. Most of yours actually use Diffio concaves, but I'm pretty sure that this one has it. Um, yeah, it look, looks great. Big, big finger spin cup. Um, but this looks like, uh, this seventy retails for $75. Um, but it, it looks like your straight up competition buy metal yo-yo. That uh, when you when you take it out of the house, you're, you're going to win something. <laughs> you know? Okay, so uh, yeah, let's throw a string on it and let's play with the thing. Alright guys, let's try this baby out. Okay, so the finger spin works really nice. Response feels good. Yeah, the response feels really nice. I like how the gap is slightly smaller on this one. Um, it's a little bigger, but even though it's a little bigger, obviously being bimetal, and then also having this nice angular design, Still very fast. The response is really nice. Uh, it, I'm getting really good binds. It's really easy to bind it. Um, but on over unders and stuff, no snags. Although my string tension's a little jacked from that finger spin. Definitely has that uh, competition throw feel. You know, very easy to land your whip tricks on it and just to hit all your bangers in general. Yeah, and the response is perfect. Like, I'm getting really good ones. And this is right out of the box. I haven't, I haven't played with it, you know, before I started filming or anything. Uh, do a thumb grind on this thing. Oh, yeah. If you like yo-yos, you want a competition-sized yo-yo, this thing is a freaking beast. Like, it, it, I mean, it just... It just goes and goes and goes, and it's really fast playing, really long spinning, really stable. It's like really everything you want. If you like these angular shapes, you're going to absolutely love this yo-yo. Oops, what did I do there? Yeah, and the finish too is also amazing for grinds, um, and it's perfectly smooth. 
Yeah. Perfect. <laughs> yeah, but I don't know. Duncan's been killing it lately. I, I absolutely really love the regular Orbit, too. So uh, the way I see it is, like, if you can afford this, get this. But I, if, if 75 bucks, yeah, that's too much money. I can't do it. Um, get the regular Orbit. The regular Orbit, I think, is probably, out of all the Duncan Yo-Yos I've checked out, it is, like, the... Um, I don't know, it, it should get more recognition than it does. It's like the, the most overlooked, like, the, like, I, I don't see how that yo-yo is not more popular. Like, it literally, like, was awesome. And it's really good for 5A as well. I can tell you right now, this will be a 5A machine, total beast. The only reason I'm not doing it is I don't want to bang it on the floor and stuff. On bimetal yo-yos, you're more likely to, it, it's, if you drop a bimetal yo-yo, there's things like the, like the ring can come unseated a little, or it can move slightly, and it can uh, make vibe, things like that. So, unless you're playing over grass, I, I usually never do 5A with bimetals. Um, unless they're like Magic Air Stealth, and that's just because I have like eight of them. So, whatever. <laughs> but, yeah, a nice area like this, I, it could probably take the beating fine. But I don't want to put it to its test. Uh, it's too nice. Uh, I'm very impressed with it. Uh, for 75 bucks, this is actually, you know, a, a great, absolutely great yo-yo. Very stable, long spinning, fast, nimble. Competition size, easy to hit your tricks on. Binds amazing. Response is good. Um, there's not really anything else you can say about it. Uh, it's got a Diffy O concave bearing, um, which I remember like 12 years ago. Those things were twenty dollars each. So I don't even I don't even know what they are now. But yeah, this thing is incredible. Like I really really like it. Um, so I'll put links down below where you can pick it up if you want. Also, to check out the the Duncan, if, if this is just like too wide for you, too expensive, you want to check something else out, obviously check out the other Orbit video, but also check out the freehand aluminum video I just did. That yo-yo, I am super impressed with too. So uh, this last week, I've had a lot of fun playing with some Duncan yo-yos, and um, let me know what other ones you want to see me check out down below in the comments. Thanks for watching, all that stuff, and I'll see you later.